guys. Enough is enough. We gotta start the show. <laughs> Just got the mic. That's oh, crazy. Yeah, oh, yeah, boy. I love it. Sounds like a I love oh, it. Oh, it's like a handed Yeah, yeah. I have a phrase. Wait, wait, he's still going to need a microphone. Check, one, two. Yeah. Check, check, one, two. Can you hear me? Check, check, check. Check, check, check. Check, can I get some wow. snare? Right, Roman yeah, voice. Not, not, not. Turn, I don't. Turn, turn it up. Oh, oh wow. He's going. He's going. He's going. Oh, he's scared. Wow. <laughs> hey, Look at this. He's scared already. Look at this. Wait. This chair. Oh. No, no, no cup dart now. What's going on? Very What's cool. going on? You broke the chair. We really kicked out yet another studio. Recliner. I've heard. What are you looking at me for? Get the book. Lord that out. We don't want anyone to know that. What? That you broke the chair? I didn't break the yes, get the back. book and block that out. Oh. Yeah, this will be the last show here, I guess. Yeah, exactly. <laughs> You're never bringing us back. That's what I said. He's not getting it. Get the book and block it out. He's going to know. When he comes in tomorrow, he's like, I hey, You're two hey, Chris, show. Studio 7. Phone's broke over there. Who's there with? Midnight movie. They're out. Exactly. They're out. They're out. No. Whatever. Don't block nothing out. Hey, but like, like, we'll blame like, it on we'll blame it on these guys. Blame it on us. Yes. <laughs> We're used to it. Yeah, yeah. yeah. you know how those rock and roll bands are. They go into care of Speaking of blaming it on us, who is us? You tell me. Who is us? Who, who, the Vinyl you? Arcade, man. What are you talking about? The Vinyl nice Arcade. Shirt. You hear us? The Vinyl Talk Arcade. about them all the time, almost every week. We appreciate We always that. have yeah. stuff yeah. hanging yeah. up in the background. We always yeah. talk about Vinyl Arcade. And you know what? Finally, they are here. What camera am I looking at? I can't, I can't even see, see the camera. Oh, she's no. lights. How many do we have? Oh, yeah, folks. Yeah. Okay, well, which one is it? Oh, God. This guy. <laughs> just, I just look straight. I can't straight. see. I just camera I can't two. see. I got my shoes and my I glasses, know. so I have them. I can't see. Saw, I can't thank see. you very much. Oh, exactly. Oh, yeah. <laughs> <laughs> nice thank saw. you. Okay. Well, we got vinyl arcade. Oh, okay, well, what? Okay, what, what, what nice shirt. What is yeah, Rich, I do love your shirt. Really. What? what is yeah, Vinyl Arcade? It's becoming on you. What is Vinyl Arcade? What let does vinyl let arcade the leader of the band tell us what Vinyl Arcade is. And then let the guys say who they are. Yeah. And let and then let the guys like say what instrument they play. And then, you know, like that. We're going to do all that. Wow, Rich. Let them do all around the game plan. Yeah. Roll in. Well, it, a little bit here. Yeah. I guess if you were going to ask the leader of the band, we'd all be talking at the same exactly. time. Because nobody yeah. knows who the leader of the band is. that? <laughs> we'll, we'll let Ed have it. <laughs> <laughs> Ed, um, Ed, Ed, no, I will say, Ed, I will say Ed, that, Ed, I will Ed. say this much: that Vinyl Arcade, uh, we uh, play '70s and '80s music, Rock and still. on and still, and and uh, <laughs> we play TV themes, fun stuff, and, and, and music that you would have heard in the movies, like. When Keith and I came up with the idea for Vinyl Arcade, the whole concept was that we were going to give people in Cleveland something different and something that really brought back the nostalgia from the 70s and 80s. So, it's, yeah, it's the music you heard on Jukebox or on Buster Morning Zoo or something, but it was the music that you, I don't know, that you'd hear that on your television set because we were all watching Saturday morning cartoons back yeah. then. Yeah. Yeah. You know, that became a real part, and we all watched the same three channels at night. Exactly. So, so, right. So it was yeah. a, the golden Tough age world. of TV themes. I really think we've lived That's through right. it. So we're bringing that back with the, huh. that, and then finding songs that, you know, maybe, I don't know, people, not everybody, maybe we'll surprise you with some songs you hadn't heard from before. We do like uh, the second hits from bands. Yeah, that's true. <laughs> Like yeah, the B sides. Sometimes B sides, sometimes but songs track. that were hits, but not as huge. Yeah, not the overdone ones. Yeah, because yeah. nobody wants to hear those. Even though we do have some of those in our set. Yeah, we, we do. Because yeah. people like them. Because people still like yeah. those. But, they do. Yeah. But we, de yeah, we definitely try and hit the ones that you don't hear all the time. But are still great. But are but still, still great. great. Yep. Exactly. Absolutely. But, but also, what else do you, besides singing the songs and the themes and the cartoon themes, TV themes, a lot of times, if the place permits, you have a screen in the back showing old commercials and old uh you know uh tv spots yeah. and stuff you well, know it, and those are fun too well that was part of the plan yeah was yeah. to add a visual element and um it was fun because we we sat down in the infamous gold top lounge and ed and i and a friend of ours john wood got together and we were spitballing ideas yeah and drinking and um <laughs> you know we do our best thinking when we're drinking so 
we came up with these ideas and we throw we kept throwing them at Ed for some reason. And Ed's like, well, why can't we do that? Well, why can't we do that? Yeah, sure, we could do that. Absolutely. And then came the hard part of doing that. <laughs> <laughs> well, you know, we the video element was not too big. You know, Syndicate, you know, Midnight mm -hmm. Syndicate being doing doing that and. Um, and working in film and stuff like that, that it wasn't that big, of, it wasn't that difficult to add a video element to the show. So yeah, there is a video element that you'll see when you come on out there. You're going to see some old commercials from when you grew up in between sets. So you don't have to be so bored in between. When we take a little break, we got stuff to play for you. And it's the, vi it's the vinyl arcade. It's the arcade. It's the g yeah. arcade games you played yeah. growing up. We you'll got see a lot of poorly it. played arcade games. <laughs> he says poorly played because when you watch the arcade games being played on the screen, <laughs> we actually played them all. We got the, uh, uh, it's eight, us playing Eight them. hours of? Eight hours of oh, us playing video games. It, 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 uh, it was great. Well, well, we couldn't move, move while we were recording it. No, we couldn't move uh, because the camera, would, the camera would shake. So we said, don't move. Oh, and like, we'd want to cheer when we did something good. But we Real high tech. Yeah, we no, Real high we're tech. Getting off, we're, getting, we're going on tangents here. That's I'll, I'll that's 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 okay. But like, no, we should introduce it. My name's Ed, and I play bass, and I play keyboards, and I sing. My name is Ed, and I play bass. <laughs> yeah, <laughs> and he's still a musician that even though he plays bass. Oh, it's oh. 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 a joke. It's oh. play keyboards. Yeah. Oh, yeah. That usually gets saved for me. Keyboards. He's the only man in Hollywood that can claim. This is How very true. That's like eight keyboard yeah, yeah, singer, yeah, yeah. bass player. <laughs> can you drum? Yes, sure. You can. Darn it. Sure. Can you play guitar? <laughs> I'm not yes. in the band. I guess. Yeah, <laughs> <laughs> yeah. Uh, I'm Keith. I play guitar and even bass. On a few songs, I'm a part-time bass player in the band, and I sing. I have, do all different types of singing. He's th he's got the angelic voice. <laughs> <laughs> I don't know about that. It's not me. Go ahead, Tom. Oh, me? I'm next. Uh, yeah, I'm Tom. I play guitar, and uh, sometimes I sing. If they let me, <laughs> they let sometimes me. it works out too. <laughs> <laughs> sometimes it works. Sound out effects, too. Tom. Oh yeah, yeah sound push, I push the little sound effects right. buttons, like the uh, Pac-Man noises and stuff here. So Jimmy's the roadie. Yeah, and I just pretty much show up wherever they go, I go. Um, I'm Jim, the drummer. Um, Keith usually, I would save the, you know, He's a singer. The non-musician in the band. <laughs> <coughs> but yes, I also sing. Uh, I also wear a couple masks and some, right. some funny right. head stuff. Um, that sounds weird. Yeah, uh, it does, but that's okay. <laughs> I don't know, but they got us, that, maybe you want to see it, though. Yeah, it's yeah, yeah, like a show, maybe you pay attention. Yeah, one maybe. <laughs> uh, but I have to say, and I say this a lot, uh, I'm extremely blessed to be in this band. Oh, Jimmy. Really, oh, really. Oh, and we're all blessed to have you. Well, yeah. that's, that's yeah. what I fish yeah, for, so thank you very much. <laughs> you guys heard it. Um, but yeah, Keith and Ed came to me right as they were putting the thing together. Uh, Keith and I almost played together in a hogwash. previous band that these two were in, yeah, Hogwash, and uh, never worked out. But uh, so I was honored when when they came to me and and asked me to you know be in the band. And I, I, I tell people also, it's like, gosh, I wish I would have come up with any of the ideas that they <laughs> did. But uh, it's just cool to be part of the band. It's a blast. First band I've been in, and I include Tom in this as well, where. <laughs> No drama, mm -hmm. no egos, everybody contributes. I mean, it's, it's well, you've been in bands. Mm -hmm. You know what that is. Exactly. Oh, oh, Jimmy, oh, thank you. Oh, my gosh. I feel like so, we're family now. Well, it's a know, it's, it's, uh, yeah. And it's just, yeah. <laughs> oh, my God, yeah. Oh, yeah, well, like, yeah. Oh, yeah, yeah. Oh, yeah. Well, I was going to say that you can, you can see one. how much fun they have while they're on stage. I mean, it's just, you know, you can kind of get a vibe. When you watch, you know certain bands, but no, it, it, trust me, you guys have to go see Vinyl Arcade live. It's such a fun time. The the, the music selection is great, you know. And uh, even my brother and my sister said the same thing when I when I took them and said, "You guys got to come see this this band." And um, they were loving the music selection too because it's not the same old, same old, but they're still good tunes. You know what I mean? It's so, perfect. Okay. Thank so you. So this yes. movie only yeah. a half hour long? <laughs> yeah, yeah. <laughs> something like that. So <laughs> we'll this movie tonight. Tonight's I'm not saying saying movie else. is. Fan favorite, okay? <laughs> yeah. White Zombie with Bela Lugosi. Nice. Yeah. Oh. White Zombie. Oh. White yeah. Zombie. A oh. Cleveland favorite, and I'll tell you why later. Why? Why? Come on, really? Yeah. Shouldn't have sat in front of me, boy. No, oh, whatever. <laughs> okay, well then, go that. start off White Zombie. You know, we come back, we'll. Uh, we can't. I already told him to start it off. Now, why are you telling him to start it off? 
because I'm giving them the segue that when we come back. You don't need a segue story. when I just segued it. God, just go. We're going to White Zombie, I said. Well, you need a segue. Speaking of drama, no drama. <laughs> 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 well, we only have like one minute for them later because you so got to You're still looking for that no drama band, <laughs> exactly. I see. Exactly, yeah. yes, I am. <laughs> Do you know where is the house of Monsieur Beaumont? Why did you drive like that, you fool? We might have been killed. Worse than that, monsieur. We might have been caught. Caught? By whom? Those men you spoke to? They are not men, monsieur. They are dead bodies. Dead? Yes, monsieur. Zombies. The living dead. Corpses taken from their graves. Or made to work in sugar mills. Heels at night. Look! Here they come! Excuse me, please. <laughs> Have you got a match? 
<laughs> okay, did I frighten you? <laughs> uh, I'm sorry. I'm ugly enough, I suppose. Oh, no, it wasn't you. Something happened back on the road there. We uh, stopped to speak to some men. Our driver told us they weren't men at all. He said they were corpses. Corpses? Surely you don't believe it, do you? No. <laughs> well, I don't know. Katie is full of nonsense and superstition. They're always mixed up with a lot of mysteries that turn your hair gray. I've been a missionary here for, oh, 30 years, and at times I don't know what to think. Come, let's go in the house. Oh, yes. Well, come, then. Is, uh, is Mr. Beaumont in? You're expected, Dr. Bruno. <laughs> yes, I, I've been sent for to marry someone. <laughs> Maybe, yeah. <laughs> oh. <laughs> yeah. Excuse me. Uh, it's, uh, how long is it that you know Mr. Beaumont? Oh, only a few days. Uh, Madeline introduced him on the docks in Port au Prince. Uh, and you? I met him on the ship coming from New York. He was very kind during the voyage. So oh, Madeline and I planned to be married the moment she arrived. But Mr. Beaumont persuaded us to come here. And he promised to take me out of the bank at Port au Prince and send me to New York as his agent. Hmm. Strange. Very strange. You. I'll tell Mr. Beaumont you're here. Yeah. It's all right, isn't it, Doctor? Oh, I guess so. You see, I... I've only met Mr. Beaumont once or twice. <laughs> but... But he never struck me like a man that would take the trouble to play a fairy godfather to a young couple like you. Unless... Unless what, sir? <sighs> I suppose you'll think I'm a meddling old fool, but... You know, I'd feel a good deal better if you'd clear out of this place after you're married and have nothing more to do with Mr. Bowman. The young people have arrived, sir, and Dr. Bruner. They're waiting in the reception hall. Show them to their room and tell them I'm out. Yes. No, wait. Perhaps I'd better see them. It might look odd if I didn't. Very odd, sir. Especially as Dr. Bruner is a trifle skeptical as to your motives, sir. Never mind my motives. Has that other person sent word yet? No, sir, not yet. He's 24 hours late. I wish you'd keep away from that man, sir. He'll make trouble for you. You needn't worry about that. I'm not afraid of him. Well, I'm not easily frightened, sir. You should know that. But what you're planning is dangerous. Don't you suppose I know that, Silver? You don't seem to realize what this girl means to me. Why, I'd sacrifice anything I have in the world for her. Nothing matters if I can't have her. I think, uh, I think you like Haiti. Uh, most people that... Oh, Madeline, I'm delighted to see you. Neil, you're more than welcome. Thank you, sir. Doctor, it is very kind of you to come. I know what a busy man you are. No, no, not at all. There's a, there's a native family live out here that I've been trying to see for a long time. After this young couple are safely married, <laughs> I'll leave. But surely you'll stay for dinner after the ceremony. Oh, no, no. No, I must run along. Well, that's a great pity. We had something very special prepared for this occasion. It was very good of you, Madeline, to humor the whim of a lonely man. There was so little time to prepare. I couldn't do half the things I wanted to do for you. 
You've, you've done more than enough already, Mr. Beaumont, for a comparison, giving Neil a position in the state. Neil? Yes, yes, indeed. Oh, yes, of course. I'm sure Neil will make a very good agent. But you must be tired after your drive. You'll get some rest. Silver. Silver will show you to your rooms. This way, please. Delighted to see you again, Monsieur Beaumont. I have been on a journey, seeking men for my mill. Men? They work faithfully. They are not worried about long hours. You, you could make good use of men like mine on your plantation. No. That's not what I want. Then perhaps you wish to talk about the young lady who came to your house this evening. You've seen her? Where? 
the road tonight. There was a young man. They're to be married tonight. You waited too long to do anything. What do you want me to do? If she were to disappear for a month, what do you hope to gain by her disappearance? Everything. Everything. Do you think she will forget her lover in a month? Just give me a month. One little month. Not in a month, nor even a year, monsieur. I have looked into your eyes. She is deep in love, but not with you. They will be married within an hour. There must be a way. That is way. The cost. The cost is heavy. You give me what I want, and you may ask anything. is very brief. You must do your share if I am to help you. Keep it, monsieur. Keep it. You may change your mind. Send me word when you use it. I'll find another way. There is no other way. All right. It's never too late. I wish you we'll talk watching. anymore. We'll don't, don't worry. Yeah, you just, we're only talking you know, for Even when he does this, you don't have to listen to him because he'll just edit No, no. Yeah, yeah, it's true. Yeah, it's yeah, 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 like, you're like, okay, yeah, it's fine. Yeah. Keep talking. He's going to be like, I'm going to trust you. you got to listen to the Rocco. Now he's up. Now we're up. Now we're up. the point. We're up. Well, you, you don't have to listen to him. <laughs> I, I, mean, I get real nervous. Yeah. 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 All right. Yeah. Hope you're enjoying yeah. White yeah. Zombie. Bella. Oh, my God. So we were sitting here. This is so a great explain movie. to us. That the one that the, the, you you, you got so mad at me, I was going to give the segue into what you were going to do. Why, why, why is it so popular here in this area, White Zombie? Because when this movie come, come out in the 30s, yeah. When this movie come out. Oh, I knew it. I knew it. I knew it. That sounds outstanding. That sounds yeah. This movie, I'll tell you. We are the last movie. Come out. Just turn around. I can't look at you. Yeah, exactly, Bella. When this movie came out, it didn't do too well. All right? No. It was it was made on a bunch of used sets from Frankenstein, from Dracula. Yeah. I hope it hope it gets some of your trivia. Yeah, I do. All these sets that it's shot on. Just kind of to capitalize on the, you know, the horror theme that was going on. But it didn't do so well upon its release. It's only like a real cheap movie, too. It's only $50,000 to make this thing. <laughs> but it, was, it didn't do too good on its opening weekend, except for in Cleveland. It broke all records 
for that week in Cleveland. It made $15,682, something like that. Wow. And the nearest other city, wherever it was, only made like $6,000 the opening weekend. <laughs> so Cleveland, for some reason, loves its white zombie. We love Bella in general. Oh, that's, a, that's a good thing. That's and right. Madge Bellamy, mm -hmm. the co stars. Mm -hmm. And so does Rob Zombie likes it. Yeah. Too. Rob liked it too. Rob liked it too, but Rob. Is I didn't know that. That's really cool. I believe that's his real name. Yeah, yeah, Rob Zombie. That's how. That's how we got. Yeah, it yeah. I, uh, but I didn't but know that about fan. Cleveland and White, and White oh, yeah. Zombie. We've always had it either. Yeah, that's cool. Of this movie. Yeah. yeah, that's amazing. And Bella only made, supposedly, according to him, he only made like eight hundred dollars, making this. Film. Yeah, because he didn't want to. Uh, he wanted just a. a uh, he wanted a, a pay up front. He didn't want to. Sign yeah. like a, a contract or yeah. whatever for. But Richard Sheffield, who whatever. we interviewed at Monster Bash a few years ago, who was a friend of Bela, claimed that he did see. Really? <laughs> really? <laughs> you do to the moon! Me. You do it to me? He to claims to have seen a tax return check or whatever that said that he made $5,000 for it. No. Which would make sense because Madge Bellamy made $5,000 for the film. So why wouldn't Bella make $5,000? <laughs> One would think. You would think. I would. No, I would think too. Yeah, I already thought about it. Interesting tidbit that, I, that it's been a long debate. It's been going on for probably seven years now in this show. Mm -hmm. Allegedly, possibly, maybe, that Frank Sinatra anonymously paid for Lugosi's funeral. <laughs> and everyone was bitching and moaning, saying, oh, no, bull, that's wrong, that's wrong. How can he? If he wanted it to be anonymous, that's why. Okay? Thank you. Why? What do you mean, that's why? 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 <laughs> I, don't wait a I just can't do it. What did you say? Well, that, because, I didn't get that. If he wanted it to be anonymous. Because it was supposed to be anonymous. So yeah. Was, right. Don't make me start this right? whole discussion again. I didn't no, I just try. I don't get what you just said. <laughs> because they. Oh God. Who's they? Please, can we just go to the next Whatever. show? Whatever. <laughs> you we'll confuse me. Because we'll have a whole. I don't want to do this. I don't want to talk about vinyl. We have guests. I don't want to rehash your old Frank Sinatra. He did his way. It's all we know. <laughs> yeah. He's not and his way was the anonymous. Yeah. 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 We don't know, though. If it was anonymous, we don't know who he's paid for. Maybe he's going to pay for mine someday. Maybe there's money in this Maybe he will. Maybe he will. Well, I hope he does. Now, okay. now, now, the, now it's getting big. <laughs> yes. The scope of the conversation yeah. Talking about drama big. and getting along. No, yeah. no, it's Take getting it big. It's getting okay. big. So, Midnight City. Yeah, obviously, yeah, obviously. mood music about anonymous funerals being oh, paid for. Oh, there you go. Anonymous By Mr. Yeah. It's your new next album. album. There you go. <laughs> See? I gave him an idea. How long have you guys been playing, you know, what got you guys started in the music, your early influences, some of your pre previous bands? Because i got, I got to know, because I'm sure I've probably seen you guys in your previous bands back in the, like, the 80s and 90s. Maybe. Oh, Had wow. them. Go ahead. Uh, yeah, go ahead. Well, no, no, I was in a, I was in a, I was in a short, uh, in the 90s, I was in a band called Mr. Nice Guy that played, like, original hair metal yeah. around the flashes and, yeah. and, 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 nice and stuff like that yeah. and stuff like that. And then, um, no, then after that, it's just been cover bands. The only other thing it would have been Hogwash. Yeah. I came out, it was Midnight Syndicate after that. I went straight into Midnight Syndicate and then um, I did Hogwash just as a little kind of mm -hmm. escape from you know, the super seriousness of, of Midnight Syndicate. Well, and Ed. The truth was he was our first <laughs> choice for bass player in the band Rubber Mullet. Rubber Mullet? Which started in 2001 and he was too Rubber busy with mullet. something called Midnight Syndicate that he couldn't be part of it. So <laughs> okay, that's right. um, yeah. then finally he decided that he needed a break <coughs> and was available. So we kicked out several bass players to get him. He had like five <laughs> bass players. You need to get rid of all of them? We got rid of five at one time. Wow. You guys are all gone. We're out. We got this guy. So, and then when Ed came into the band, we decided to change the name to Hogwash. Hogwash, one of my favorite bands ever. Too. It was a it was a long tenure. I just want to see you guys. Yeah. What about you? What bands were you in? Hogwash and Rubber Mullet. I was in a band in high school called Above and Beyond, and we were lousy. No, we were a lot of fun. It was a lot of fun. We actually competed very well at the Battle of the Bands in Geauga County back in 1987. <laughs> but that's all I got. Oh, you. oh I'm, I'm next? Uh, I was in a band called Toehead in, from like 94 to 96. We played around. It was it was a good time. We, we did pretty good. Toehead, what kind of music? It was like 90s, like grunge kind of stuff. We played with deaf, deaf kids that play, deaf children that play a lot. And then I had a bunch of kids and didn't play music for years. Mm -hmm. And then that was played with uh, another band for a few years before this and got with these guys. What about you? Tell it all stuff. I saw, 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 I saw,
Um, <laughs> we'll be right back. Yeah, several yeah. bands, all cover bands, except for one. I was in a band called The Sharks in the mid '90s. Um, still, you've probably never heard of it, but um, it was Tim Lang and Bob Sabraco. Um, but yeah, just a bunch of cover bands over the years. Uh, like I said, I had almost got into hogwash at one point. Um, Our drummer was ready to step down. Things yeah. were a little too busy for him, and uh, so I had seen Jimmy in Trainwreck, right. and I was very impressed with his playing and singing. So I said, well, you know, if this goes through, we'll go ahead and call you, but that never happened. No, and he Todd's a, an amazing drummer. Oh, I was a little yeah. frightened to step into his shoes. But, uh, yeah, just a like, rest bunch of cover bands that nobody's probably heard of. <laughs> but fun. I, I played pretty much consistently from, like, 1989 <laughs> till today. So thank goodness my lovely bride let me get out and do some like jamming. like 6.5. <laughs> Is that when it started? Well, no. <laughs> but enough about us. They play things from the 80s. Yeah, oh, that's right. right. They play anything. Let's get to it. Hey, Trip, what band were you in? Oh, yeah. You had to be in Duh. some bands. Angels Rage. Nice. Love the name. Ooh, hard like and heavy. Was it? Nice. Is that nice. metal? Angels oh, Rage. Yeah. Oh, that's yeah. original. And it was all original. Oh, nice. Um, we threw a couple. Played flashes? Of, but no, oh, okay. we never really. We played like a couple times. and No, it's, it's uh, the guitar players kind of beginner I just started drumming so we were just we weren't ready but we had like five or six originals we played a party one time um, Ooh, we played we a party one no, time no yeah. I'm getting, getting there oh, oh, yeah. oh, I thought All that right. was the big gig <laughs> yeah, and you're having a good time and then we played no, we, no not them um, <laughs> see um, I'm good friends with Fashion Police oh, oh yeah and, uh, sure. and name 1988 oh. okay. name dropper so <laughs> Uh, yeah. I expect that, 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 that check in Two the mail. Yeah. So, oh, but yeah. you know, so they would like let us open up and, and yeah, get on there. So we did Quins, we did. Uh, oh, uh, so you were uh, like uh, East Lake Willow kind of guy. Yeah, yeah, that's where I'm. That's from. where I'm from too. Yeah. yeah. <laughs> nice. So, um, and then you know the singer quit, tried to get another singer, and you know you, you have kids, oh. you get a house. Oh crap! We gotta go back to the movie trip. I'm sorry. Oh, whatever. So just keep rambling on. So you know, and then just anybody needs a book for a birthday party. I still anything. No, He's but I still drum Fancy. every once in a while. So um, when I show up to a vinyl arcade show, no. uh, you got to come up and play. No. I think I've seen your set list. I might have a song or two I might want to jump on there. Let's do this. Oh, Lord. Yeah. Why not? We, let us know. We'll no, bring a camera. Do you guys play uh, next segment? Uh, the, a face-off next segment. But Oh, I've been oh this is a good one. You too. talked about the face-off This is a good one. I know what his answer is going to be, but we're going to argue. But anyway. <laughs> oh, man. Yeah, you talked about yeah. Up this no, face off no. last week. You were like, this face off. You, guys, be uh, so you, got, you guys do uh, Don't Tell Me You Love Me from Light Ranger? We did. Yeah, we have. We did. We yeah. have. Yeah. Think yeah. Learn it again. Okay. Learn it yes, again. But you don't have to worry about yeah. learning the drums. No, I'll play it. No, we're going to get into the guitars. Anyway, <laughs> so. Jimmy's going to do the guitar solo. Did you guys learn Land of the Lost? Yeah, because I can't do it. You guys got to learn Land of the Lost. Let's get back to it. Oh, that's a good one. while he's digressing. Someone's got to learn the banjo. All right, he's. Okay, wait. Oh, wait, wait. Go ahead. Take you. Okay, the teaser. Sequay, whatever you say. Head to head face off. Next segment is going to be because we have musicians here and. And, you know, uh, love the same kind of music and we tons of back to the movie. Who was, who <laughs> was more influential when it came to the sp stage spectacles of a live show? What are you doing is with it those arms? Alice Cooper or was it Kiss? Don't oh. hit the don't hit the band. Oh, that's when we come what? back. Alice we'll, Cooper, what did you just say? Oh my God! Pay attention. <laughs> I can't. Yeah, you hear me? You're, you're too busy telling him that. Go to the, go to the, go to the, go to the, go to the movie. Then that's when you start talking again <laughs> and cry. Chop. You told me to hurry up, so I went. No, I got you talking with your hands. Uh, yeah, I mean, karate chop. You're getting yeah, very close to the drummer. Bad. I'm thinking you're gonna hit something. Oh, uh, just uh, go back. <laughs> we come back. We're gonna. Oh talk. my Lord, go we're back. Talk. White zombie. Driving away evil spirits. Close it. Close it. Miss Madame. I love you, Madeline. 
more than anything else in this whole world here. Heaven or hell lies a mystery for me. You can raise me up to paradise, or you can blast my world into nothingness. There's time even yet, dear. I can make you the envy of every woman. I'd give my life to make you happy. Oh, listen to me, dear, before it's too late. Don't. Please. Don't go into that room. We can be in Port au Prince in half an hour. There's a boat sailing at midnight. You've been so wonderful. Don't spoil everything. Now. One last gift before I lose you forever. We are gathered together here in the sight of God and in the face of this company to join together this man, this woman, in holy matrimony. Say. My wife, 
Zombies. Yes. They are my servants. Did you think we could do it alone? In their lifetime, they were my enemies. I go, a witch doctor. Once my master. Secrets I tortured out of him. Van Gelder does wine, swollen with riches. He fought against my spells until the last. Him yet I have trouble hiding. His Excellency Richard, once Minister of the Interior. Garcia, brigand chief. Marquis, captain of gendarmerie. And this, this is Chauvin. The high executioner almost executed me. I took them, just as we will take this one. But what if they regain their souls? They will tear me to pieces. And that, my friend, shall never be.
Madeline. <laughs> yeah, they want to see Murder Machine again. Are you sure? Uh, what, what are you sure? <laughs> <laughs> Jeez, that was not a vote of confidence. The <laughs> rocker goes, you sure? He asked for it. He said, when's the last time we, we spin I Murder Machine? we're going to show a movie first. I have to get all the guess what? out of that movie. We're going to show the Deep Dark Woods No Witnesses. Because I've been, I'm going to work on that one and get that. You're not. Uh, are we back on? I think yeah. we're, we're back on. Where are you? Are we on? Are we on? Game over here. Oh, that was what it is. <laughs> is that what that was? Yeah. Yeah. No, yeah. yeah. Well, it's live. We've it has different ways of telling us we're on. <laughs> I've been sitting here for a long time. Wow. Have we been on? We do great. Yeah. 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 When you're on set, you're always on. Yeah, never know. it's true. Yeah, it's very true. Gotcha. Never know. Are we on? He's like the ringmaster. We're on. Okay. All right. Good. Very good. He wants no witnesses. How about just the original Deep Dark Woods? See, he always got to change it up. You give him an idea, he changes well, why, it. Why you say it's only an hour? I have an hour version of it. Mm -hmm. I know you got an hour, but that's, that's not the good movie. That's like <laughs> it's like Ed's movie. He had a show that doesn't matter, right? He did the original, right? Right. Nine and, and then, then you did the better version. Yeah. I want to show the better version, like he showed yeah. his better version. Yeah. <laughs> he goes, he goes. Well, show the hour version, the one that I have, the simple, short one. Oh. I mean, we could show that one because guess what? Nobody gets to see that one because I don't show that one now because I show the it's new version. Show the better version. Exactly. Plus, somebody screwed me over and, and used a VHS, whatever it was, instead of using this good camera because they didn't think I was serious, Ed. He didn't think that we would shoot a horror movie all in one day, a complete film in one day. Okay. Or you I think you I give, own. Or are you giving Ed the business now? No, I'm, we, we're sharing. We're oh. sharing. We're, we're lamenting our, our, we're we're lamenting oh, our initial who, who forays into filmmaking. And we'll take who, any who business you, who we you, can get. Who are you mad yeah. at? Right yeah. Yeah. I'm not mad, but Give Rocco. Oh. Business. Rocco business. was supposed to use his good camera, <laughs> but, he's, but he, instead he used, what was that we used? High 8. High 8. Oh, high oh. Eight. Because he didn't think Come on, that guys. I was serious at <laughs> shooting a whole horror movie in one day. I own some sort of a title. I just used the high 8 or whatever. Yeah, he goes, this is good enough because I didn't know. Because no, I it, say, say it, it right, say enough. it right. Yeah, yeah, and I said, okay. It's whatever. you and Tom Savini, man. All your different titles. Yeah, yeah, I got a title. <laughs> one, a horror movie in one day. <laughs> one title. That's right. <laughs> <laughs> started when it was dark. Rocco tight. Started when it was dark, and we ended when the sun was going down. Perfect. One day. One that's day. Pretty cool. cool. That's, that's cool. actually cool. pretty cool. I'd actually, yeah, yeah, I, I kind of want to see it. Okay. Me too. Watch it. If I want to see it, we'll show it. Let's do it. I want to see it too. I see it. Watch it. We all. I'm in. It's, 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 Have us on when you spin it. You want to come? Yes. Hey, will you come back? I, please. All right. All right. Oh, if he gets to hold the microphone, he'll be here. Yeah. 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 Just, yeah. We'll, then turn we'll, it on. We'll tear it apart. Yeah. We'll even turn it on next time. Yeah. Yeah. We'll tear it apart then, too. We'll, like, laugh at it and stuff. Yeah, that's a good idea. All right, no, good. We'll do know. that. Hey, you saw <laughs> Hey, They promised to come back, and we'll show the original Deep Dark Woods. Ooh. Speaking of Deep Dark Woods. Ooh. What? Let's go to this yeah, deep, go to dark face-off here. Oh, yeah, that's yeah. about Ooh, nice face segue. Off. Yeah, yeah, that's a good like segue. Face-off. Segue. Now, what was the more influential band when it came to the, 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 the stage theatrics, the stage, putting on a stage show? Okay? 
Is it Alice Cooper, who was known for more of like almost putting on a, 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 a horror show? Or was it Kiss, more of the theatrics and the explosions and the, the rockets and the flames and the fire? Got two big time choices here, but only one can come out. Theater the and rock and roll? Is it theater and rock and roll? This is a <laughs> Wait, what? <laughs> the, the more influential. Don't throw an asterisk out here. Uh, Go ahead, Ed. Question? question him. Question no. Him. no. <laughs> I just want to make sure the I... The more influential band when it came to the face stage. Off. This is a big it's, face it's off. Big. It's pretty big. It is. I don't really. want to mess it up. Why did I just say? I was saying what was more influential in theatrics in rock and roll shows? Setting the standard for like showing a stage show. Got it. Okay. Got it. Thank you. I'm sorry. So we're going to go right around the horn. What's your Timothy? Alice Cooper. <laughs> I can't. <laughs> it's, I, oh, I have to pick it, and then we talk. And then we talk about it. Yeah. Yeah. It's tough. Yeah. I, it's, I'm telling you, it's tough. I it's gotta really go with Kiss. See? Ed. Kiss. Kiss. I can't. Even, I don't even have to think about it. Alice Cooper. Mm -hmm. See? <laughs> now, now, <clears throat> when I when I first thought of this question, I thought, no, guy. it's too easy. No, it's I'm gonna be kidding. Kiss. But I started thinking, I'm going Alice Cooper. Why are you picking? You say it, Alice Cooper. Yeah, right? I say Alice Cooper. But then you know, if, if you say he probably wasn't more influential, but I think he had more of an impact with the type of show that he did. I think it was a bigger or more of a slap in the face of how things were always done. The only other guy I could think of would be like a uh, um, Alex Harvey, mm -hmm. uh, but not to that horror extent. But yeah, I, I think he did something that had never been done hasn't been done since at least not well um so for me it was just more of a it's more memorable and impactful but potentially not as influential so, so that, that's why i more influential it's than more influential i guess i gotta go with kiss now he changes it to well, kiss. But I, <laughs> you talk yourself out of your answer. <laughs> 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 no, no, you talk yourself out. Am I the only one that it says Alice no, Cooper? No, I said Alice Cooper. Okay, okay. Yeah. Yeah. <laughs> when he start to change my mind. <laughs> but see, I'm surprised, I'm surprised that you hesitated. I thought for sure you'd be kissed without even hesitating. Well, no, there's... I mean, you hesitated, so there was some Okay, I'm not going to talk myself out of my <laughs> answer, <laughs> but I will give you... That was good. Uh, uh, that's, that's good. good. That's good. That's good. <laughs> All right. Well, valid points. Yes, uh, valid valid points about Alice Cooper was Alice Cooper's stage show was very cool. I thought it was... It was almost like a magic show. He chopped his own yep. head off. He had a cyclops. Yep. I mean, who has a cyclops? <laughs> Not Except enough for a guy with an iPad. Not, not, but, not enough high yeah. Cyclops. But yeah, there's not enough Cyclops in entertainment. <laughs> that's true. No, that's true. Cyclops. But anyway, cool. um, but I think he started doing most of that. Seventy six. Yes. See, I was trying to get the timeline there too of mm -hmm. what because the Alice Cooper show, his epic live mm -hmm. album, was seventy seven. Uh -huh. But he did wear the makeup first to the extent. Sure. No, he was a character with a band. Yeah. KISS was four huge personalities and they each had their own thing that happened during that show and I think as far as theatrics you had a levitating drum riser, you had mm -hmm. guns going off, you had fire breathing and all that with KISS well, uh, and I just think they were, they, I think they took Alice Cooper and made it better. Mm -hmm. That's me. Well, yeah. That's a good good point. Right, I'll go. Boy, I mean I, if I, I just in the efforts of moving this along, I really have nothing else to add that Keith didn't say already. I have to say, kiss for all those reasons, and, and they definitely did, they brought it to a level. They brought it to a level of popularity with the general. You have to uh, mm. credit them because they took they took this theatrical show and then did it in such a way that appealed to a very wide audience and therefore elevated rock shows and theatrics and rock shows for everyone because it just took so many more people saw this and their minds were blown open. There has to be something to be said about the popularity of something like that. Yeah, I, I didn't hesitate because, I mean, Kiss is the band that launched a thousand smoke bombs. I mean, they're like, they're, you know, they're why every kid wanted to pick up a guitar and blow up their garage. You know? Me included. Yeah, I was, I was trying to light all kinds of stuff on fire around me and play my guitar. <laughs> Because yep. this cause it was, you know, I was like, oh my god, this is crazy. It's yeah. like the circus, but with fire and, and blood and lightning or whatever. <laughs> yeah. It was awesome. And all the other stuff that he said. And Ed. <laughs> so that was me. Well, I said Alice Cooper because you're talking about KISS. Now, I'm a certified KISS Army member, okay? Okay. Like, I love <laughs> nice. KISS. But KISS 
They brought a spectacle to a show. You see a KISS show, it's a spectacle. Mm -hmm. The music's awesome, but you're seeing a spectacle. Whereas Alice Cooper has crafted a character, like he was saying, he's Alice. He's Alice Cooper, right? Even the songs. That's why is this guy's name Alice, right? And the song. Mm -hmm. And he crafts a story with it, with visuals, music, character. And so I think, I think theatrically, yeah, I yeah. think he is the and most And that's a good iconic. point, because mm -hmm. he would do themes to each song. Yeah. He would do an act it almost was for every right. theatrical. Right. Whereas yeah. Kiss is spectacle. Yeah. Well, yeah. It's a good face-off. It's a great face-off. It's a great face-off, <laughs> <That's a great laughs> face yeah. like, because it is. These are all yeah. valid points. Thank you. I, yeah. What was that? Excuse you. <laughs> that sounded like Excuse a spectacle. <laughs> <laughs> that sounds very kiss. 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 Very Elaborate that they did once they hit, you know, True. 77, 78. I think uh, they got bigger then. I think the Alive tour, the mm -hmm. 74, 75 started. is when they really but took on the bigger. I think I said Alice Cooper because, yeah, maybe I think Kiss took, even if Kiss's stage show was, let's say it first, and then Alice Cooper came around, I think Kiss elevated theirs, I think, because of Alice Cooper. I think Alice didn't have yeah. a lot of the explosions, but you know it was it was mesmerizing to watch his shows, and it wasn't the same thing every year. It was different. The Kiss was you know let's have a bigger explosion, let's have a you know more blood coming out of you. Came to expect <laughs> more. the same thing, mm -hmm. but Alice was you know, right. You said magic show. I, I went to one of his shows, and it was like holy crap! How the hell did he? I mean, I watched a, a magician just now. Mm -hmm. I mean, you were blown away just watching this, and I just would leave. Uh oh, oh God, what happened there? Got to so an explosion. Got to so I just <laughs> I did my movie theatrics. They both, they both set such high standards for a stage show. Agreed. For bands that follow, but I just think that Alice was more influential, and I think a lot of the other bands took took it from him, and you know. Ran with Who it. does that? But now? it was such a close call because they were both. Who phenomenal. does that now? Rob Zombie. Phenomenal. Justin Bieber. No, Justin, Justin Bieber. Bieber. But the Bieber. 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 You're right. Did I talk you back into it? So you're back to hell. Come on, three to three again. Rocco, you got you got to be the tiebreaker again. Rocco, tiebreaker. What do you say? I have to go kiss because I've never seen. Um, you can't go kiss then. Oh, uh, <laughs> I gotta. Uh, what's wrong with you? Right, right. Me and yeah, exactly. baby. <laughs> Alice Cooper, freaking phenomenal. He is. I fist he's bumped him. Oh, he has so many cool mm -hmm. songs. He, he's, too. He's, he's, uh, he's amazing. Hey, and he's a good guy too. Yeah, he oh, he's excellent. excellent. He plays a lot. Everybody that I've ever met, you know, when you meet these uh, these rock stars, you hope that they're cool people. Yeah. But like everybody that's met, Alice Cooper and, and Dio, Ryan James Dio. Dio, yep. is I never have yet heard yet a single say, "Oh, they're just such great nope. people." So how cool is that? Dio, Dio, a lot of people say that about phenomenal. Gene Simmons too. Phenomenal. What's that? Yeah. So a lot of people say that about Gene Simmons. Yeah. That's yeah. surprising, <laughs> right? <laughs> that was the joke part. Of it's a joke. Yeah, oh, no, it's a joke. But a bump. I guess <laughs> that is a joke. It is a joke. It's, it's a, a terrible guy. joke. I did. I, that's probably why. Like people, but you're, you're talking about people that meet him. We're back on. So maybe he's on his best behavior. Yeah. Right. Who's that? Gene Simmons. I heard he was a. He's, he's a hardcore a horror fan. Is he? He is. Oh. See, that's why I saw. So, yeah, I thought it was a possibility. Yeah. You know no. how he. You know how he got his. Uh, his design for his boots? I just follow you. Whatever was you the, say. Uh, leave it. Yeah, what's the name of that movie we show? Godzilla. No. I don't know. It's almost like Godzilla. What's the movie we show? What movie show is almost like it. Godzilla? Mothra. Who? Gorgo. Oh. Gorgo. Look at the cover and the monster of Gorgo. Yeah. And one of yeah. uh, Simmons' oh. earlier uh, boots. Oh. Okay. Came from 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 that movie. Nice. But. Cool. And he was a huge Boa Lugosi fan. Mm. Aha! That's why we're showing White Zombie tonight. Whoa. Tribute. Hey, there we go. In here. Nice Dude, job. that was good. Yeah. yeah. Plus, segue. Coming around. Right up on our lineup. Say. Speaking of movie, I guess we better go back to oh, the movie. Yeah. We oh, come back to the trivia. What? He hasn't waved. 
Right. Well, he's. Oh, now he's about to. Okay. Okay. Yeah, don't go. All right, back. He's off. Lost it. He's fixing lights and stuff. Yeah, yeah, yeah. We had some. We had a face off again, Mr. Beat. I love the discussion. Yeah, it's a good question. I'm sorry. It was a good face off. Let's just do a show of face off. Yeah, just a face off show. We'll call it face off. Oh wait, that's face off. There's two explanations to strike me. Either the body was stolen by members of a death cult that use human bones in their ceremonies, or else... Or else what? She's not dead. Not dead? Are you mad? I saw her die. The doctor signed a certificate. I saw them bury her. Now, wait a minute. Wait a minute. I'm not mad. But I've lived in these islands for a good many years. And I've seen things with my eyes that made me think I was crazy. There's superstitions in Haiti that the natives brought here from Africa. Some of them can be traced back as far as ancient Egypt. And beyond that yet, in the countries that was old when Egypt was young. Yes, but what has that to do with Madeline? I kissed her as she lay there in the coffin. And her lips were cold. Let me explain. Now, just a minute. I'll explain. Wherever there is a superstition, you will find there is also a practice. Now, do you remember what your driver told you the night he took you to Beaumont's house? Oh, about those horrible creatures yeah. we saw. Yeah. He said they were corpses yeah. taken from their grave. That's it. Now, wait. Now, that's the superstition. Now, for the practice. The ghouls that steal the dead corpses from the graves I supposed to put him there in the first place. Do you mean that Madeline was murdered so that somebody could steal her dead body? Ah, nonsense. No, no. Not her dead, not her, uh, her body, yes, but not her dead body. That's what I mean. Well, surely you don't think she's alive in the hands of natives? Oh, no, better dead than that. <laughs> Excuse me, please, have you got a match? Thank you. <clears throat> You don't believe that, do you? Say, there's been lots of people that's been pronounced dead that came alive again and lived for years. Now, if, it's, if nature can play pranks like that, why isn't it possible to play pranks with nature? Oh, I don't know. Your driver believed he saw dead men walking. He didn't. What he saw was men alive in everything but this and this. Oh, the whole thing has me confused. I just can't understand it. Uh, I don't blame you. I don't blame you. I've been trying for years to get to the bottom of this thing. To separate what you call fact from fiction. The law, the law of Haiti acknowledges the possibility of being buried alive. Here it is in the penal code. I'll read it for you. It's in French. Do you speak French? No. <coughs> Excuse me, please. Have you got a match? Okay, right here. Here's one. Oh, thank you. I didn't see it. <coughs> I'll translate it for you. If you should fit. Article. Article 149. The use. The use of drugs or other practices which produce lethargic coma or lifeless sleep shall be considered attempted murder. Yes. Attempted. Yes, I see. Yeah. All right, all right. If the person has been buried alive, the act should be considered murder, no matter what result follows. Beaumont. I say, you said that you couldn't understand why he was so interested in us. Do you think he did this? No. No, I think it's native work. Native work, exactly. Of course, if you want to, we can go to Beaumont's house first. If I can get my hands on the devil that's responsible for this, I'll make him such an example that every witch doctor in Haiti will be shaken in his sandals. But we can't do this alone. Can't the authorities help? <laughs> Not a... <laughs> Neil, my boy. You don't know these islands. The native authorities are afraid to meddle. I'm not. I got friends among the natives. 
He'll tell me things that no gendarme could ever get out of. Because I'm a preacher, they think I'm a magician. Before we get through with this thing, we may uncover sins that even the devil would be ashamed of. Oh, these bitch stuff. things. They can't bring back the light to those eyes. I was mad to do this. But if you'd have smiled on me, I'd have done anything for you, given you anything. I thought that beauty alone would satisfy. But the soul is gone. I can't bear those empty, staring eyes. Oh, forgive me, Madeline, forgive me. I can't bear it any longer. I must take you back. Back to the grave, monsieur? No. You must put the light back into her eyes and bring laughter to her lips. She must be gay and happy again. You paint a charming picture, monsieur. One that I should like to see myself. Bring her back. Aren't you trifle afraid, monsieur? How do you suppose those eyes will regard you when the brain is able to understand? to see hatred in them than that dreadful emptiness. 
Perhaps you're right. It would be a pity to destroy such a lovely love. Let's drink to the future of this flower. A glass of wine? Silver, bring wine. We have a toast to drink. To the future, Monsieur. Only a pinpoint, Monsieur. The cloud, or perhaps a glass of wine. What are you trying to do to me? I have other plans for Mademoiselle. And I'm afraid you might not agree. I have taken a fancy to you, Monsieur. Silver! Silver! The future, Monsieur. He's doing things. And I love you. I like Jaws 3D. And myself. I had asthma <laughs> yeah, I had as a kid, so when I breathe, it sounds like it. All right. So, all right. Yeah. So, <laughs> well, well, I'm all the nice possessed. Hey. You know, hey, hey. I had hours. Yes, you are, son. And I lived in a plastic bubble. He's, he's, he's gone back into the past. The boy in the plastic bubble. That was me. That was me. Was it? 
Just yeah. forget about it. If you're so at home, you're right there, there, man. Just call. Years so, old. So I call his I phone number. In ten for ten wow. days. Wait, what is it? Hey. It's you now. You're going to be strong. I cannot get him to function. He's like a bull. Whatever. Will you function? We're rambling. You're off. You're off. He's rocking. 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 We do have to get oh, lights on. Sorry. We're going to have some coherence. I'm just happy I'm yeah. showing off my wife. They don't get enough love. Oh. I was going to mention oh, They don't get enough love. Man. I love them. They don't get enough love. They think they have a but we are Satan's people. Sexual yeah. perverts. Yeah. These guys, they yeah. two are all over Cleveland. Yes, one of the best. Yeah. Oh, that's great. I love this guy. Other. You guys want to be somebody we take oh, out of here. Oh, uh, no, we did. I'm sorry. Do I we got some good guests here. We talk about the same stuff. <laughs> I'm talking about vinyl arcade. Well, I don't That's know. That's what we're talking about. We're talking about a lot. Uh, we are. <laughs> are we out? Oh, we're oh, not. Wait. We're in. I don't know what we're we are. In. We're out. We're out. We're out. We're out. We're out. We're out. Trivia time. Wonderful. We've been talking for a white zombie. I know. Yeah. White zombie. Hey, don't you have a little index card of trivia? I do, but oh, that's fantastic. from last show. Oh, oh. <laughs> I can't read it. It might work for tonight's show. So I didn't need it tonight because I'm like, oh, man, Vinyl like Kate's going to be there. I don't even need this crap. Nah. We'll be <laughs> ramble all night long. That's what we're doing. Yeah. Oh, uh, uh, where'd that come trivia. from? Trivia. Maybe did I write any notes about this? Mm. Do you know what Bella Lugosi's name, character's name is in this movie? Yes. What is it? Murder Legendre. Legendre. Nice. Trivia. <laughs> There's a two-parter. Mm -hmm. Two-part uh -huh. trivia tonight. Two hours. Number one. <laughs> One is one. number one. <laughs> what is? How's that number one? What is the? What? You're like number one. <laughs> number one. Pinky. Pinky. <laughs> number one. You yeah, better not do this. Can't even do that. Yeah. Yeah. I'm giving a freaking single. <laughs> yeah, it, it, yeah get the book. Yeah, put the smoke bomb up in that Christ. Are you going like we're doing? God. God. Let's all do it. Why am I allowed to do that okay. and make Paco put smoke bombs up in the Everybody do it. Oh. I'm just sitting like this. Yeah. Now you got smoke bomb. Okay. Number one. Number one. What? does Legendre mean? Number two, his character's name is what? Murder Legendre. Murder Legendre. What is the very odd thing about that character's name in this movie? Doesn't murder anybody? <laughs> Who's named murder, for one thing? Yeah. Murder yeah, Machine. That. I've heard of let's, that. I've heard let's that call him movie, Murder. Yeah. Murder. Murder Legendre. Murder. It's lame questions, but murder. She wrote. There's not murder. murder. I mean, I can go to the well and get another Bella Lugosi trivia that we've done yeah, over and over, well. over again. Didn't feel like doing that because then he'd be. Oh, I'm like, oh get the book. Oh, jeez, really? <laughs> Profanity. Beep. At least wow. once a week. That's right. Once a week. Wow. Yeah, once a week. <laughs> once a week. Profanity. And sometimes it's he cable, forgets right? to mark the book. I know he does. <laughs> I know he does. Yes, he uh, does. Hey, but Bella. Bela. Yeah. You know what they said about this movie? What they said. I told you they write they, they filmed this on a lot of pieces of old sets. Frankenstein, um, or some of the other old bunch of old sets, all right. They pieced this thing together. Because they were being cheap. And they used a lot of former silent film stars in this thing. Which you all know about silent film stars. Now they're, you know, they're sound, they don't yeah. have to act. Really, anybody could have been a silent film star. Right? Good so yeah. they were doing like silent film style acting in this thing, which <laughs> made it really choppy. And That's over the top, I would imagine. Right well, <laughs> under the top, <laughs> like, really. Yeah. Almost like you were like, 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 yeah. like I was telling you, like I do that. Like I started in theater, so when I do on the film, I go big. <laughs> I go over, <laughs> and I'm watching myself. Oh, yeah. Yeah. I can't do this. All you need to do, Ed, in this scene is walk up to wow. the mailbox, pull out something, look at it, go, okay, and leave. And well, sure enough, I'm like, <laughs> <laughs> the <Whoa>. over-exaggerated, <laughs> whoa, what? No. Can't turn it down. Can't take it a notch. But that's what I must, I, I would have been great silent actor. It's you and Robin Williams, yeah, man. You I would have rocked, rocked the white zombie world. Yeah. Is, that, is, that, is, that, is, that, is that a good against Robin Williams? You don't like him? Yeah. Robin Williams? Yeah. Robin Williams? Yeah. Saying, you, you don't like Robin Williams? Oh, yeah. no, I'm, I'm good with Robin Williams. Okay. I love Robin Williams. So he don't like, we don't <laughs> like you about Robin Williams. You don't like him? I don't know that. He thinks, yeah, because you, he over, he over. He thinks he's a great actor. He did, went over. Well, he was not a great actor. I think he's a very good actor. Oh, he's amazing. What? No, 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 no. I played you that thing from Opie and Anthony. I know you did. That, yeah, after I started listen to a stand-up, 
eh, he's not that funny. It was just he's over he's overdoing. So you, mm -hmm. you like laugh and yes. you're like, why am I even laughing? Because what he said wasn't even. Funny. But as a serious actor, he's but, pretty good. Yeah, I thought. But he, as an actor, I think he's really good. Look at the the uh, variety you know, of roles yeah, he played. But it's played. hard not yeah. to look at him. The same guy. The same guy. Doesn't even like Michael Keaton. Okay. <laughs> See, I argue with him about Michael Keaton. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Michael Keaton's Michael Keaton was the best Batman. And he was the best Batman in the movies. And and he doesn't even. He doesn't like Denzel Washington either. I think he's crazy. Denzel, 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 Denzel is a great actor. I don't even actor. know who the best Batman is. Who's the best Batman? Who? I don't, best don't Batman? even know. I can't. George Val Clooney, Kilmer. right? Val Kilmer. Oh, Get out of that. <laughs> Kick him out of the band. Come on. Val, Val Kilmer. Clooney was a it's good a Batman. Val Kilmer wasn't terrible. Yeah, he was Clooney wasn't Batman. terrible, honestly. No. Michael oh, Clooney was the original Batman. Adam West. Even Jack Nicholson was a great Joker. Okay? Yeah, she was. I'm this guy keeping his, keep his yeah, party good, but no, he, he was, 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 was just I can't stand back. But he was back. more loose and kind yeah. of, you know. I mean, he didn't yeah, really I guess. Well, keep well, as stiff did. as a board. Did right. I don't know. Melted, yeah. you know, yeah. all yeah. down yeah. muscles. I made a Robert Newton's creature effects company with those carved on muscles. He won't shut up now. It's okay when he's got a point to make. I'm talking to Ed. It's okay when he's got a point to make. I don't have a point to make. What are we talking about? But he's making Because I was talking to Ed. Oh, God. <laughs> now it's your fault. It is my fault. Way to go, Ed. How, do, how can we find I'm over Vinyl Arcade over on social media? I'm overacting. How can we find big. Vinyl Arcade on social media? Oh, like, where you're playing out, Facebook yeah. pages, yeah. all that stuff? Yeah, VinylArcade.com is our it's website. It's a good start spot. Yeah, because yeah. yeah. you can go anywhere on social media from, from there. there. all your links up there. Right. I, don't, I mean, we're on Facebook. If you just put in Vinyl Arcade. Uh, we come up first. We do come up first. There is... A couple other ones. Yeah, but there's there's one out in Texas, but totally different genre, to totally different. I mean, and we've actually talked to them and so. But yeah, just punch in Vinyl Arcade and and you'll find it. But yeah, Vinylarcade.com because yeah. that's got our store, yeah. right? And we're well, you can buy you can buy this wonderful merchandise, <laughs> right? You sell this stuff? Oh yeah, yes. <laughs> we sell t-shirts. We do, Rich. Wow. As a matter of oh, fact, question. Matter. question. Question. Midnight question. Movie T-shirts. I, yeah. I can I can get right. Oh, we sell yeah. merchandise Good. as well. No, it's fine. Super duper. Okay. Oh, that's oh, we have hats, pollinate. shirts. We should cross pollinate. Let's get DVD. We should, we should put those on our. <laughs> I won. I won. You won the one. That I won it for 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 Tuesday. But then when you went and you talked on Roger Miller, I oh, shared the did. post when they oh. talked, you talked on Roger. So you were one of the winners. So you know, I was one of the winners. So now there's a big midnight movie nice. on the, on my base case. Nice. And uh, I have the DVD, which is fantastic. And I collection of some of those. You have to win. Wonderful. All right. I love and I, I would have worn my midnight movie shirt, but I was wearing, I wore it as smelly. I didn't want to. I don't want to through that. I wear it a lot. I wear it a lot. He's out in the yard working. working. That's because <laughs> midnight movie T-shirts are printed and stuff. Yeah, we're going to get a whole day. Unfortunately, so if you wear the stuff, merchandise nice. guy, he's not here tonight. No, yeah, he's I missed Denny. Oh, Denny. Say hi to Denny. We go hey, I got. I got to put yeah. my daughter real quick. Who just? Who, if you can see this shoe here with the schmutz. Yeah, there's schmutz on of it there. My the daughter hand does. painted these shoes. Nice. Oh. Arcade they're beautiful. I'm sorry. Yay. Just that's oh. Dana. Those are not for sale. I actually my, tried to get a custom Dana. set made through Vans, and they shot me down, saying that I didn't own the logo or oh, something. Okay. <laughs> yeah, yeah. Idiot. Yes, I do. <laughs> yeah. Yeah. But no, they wouldn't make just a one-off pair of shoes. No. And they were going to charge me twice as much anyway, so I'm glad I don't have well, them. I like Dana's shoes better. She would make yeah. you a pair if you wanted. Well, well, yeah. Take her a long time. With she needs a huge foot there. Yeah. <laughs> Mine are a lot tinier. Yeah. And we're getting new hats soon. Ooh, I mean, those a new style. model. Yeah, I like that. I like, I like the that. dash of red in there. It's like yeah, yeah. yeah. too. Yeah. We like that. Don't Big Dent is working on that right now. Oh, so that's great. I'm trying to get some new merch. Yeah, I can't wait to get I need to get clearly more. Yeah. Okay, so let's go finish off, right? Mm -hmm. Wait, mm -hmm. we're gonna finish off white zombie, zombie oh, and we come okay. back give you the answer to that horrible lame trivia. Cool. cool. Carter, cool. Chat a little bit more with Vinyl Arcade, and then we'll say good night. All right. Not Maybe right. Maybe I can think of another face-off to close this show out. Oh, <laughs> short face-off. Uh, yeah. All right. We'll figure something out. I'll nice. think of another face-off. We ought to be picking up an old rich doctor around here pretty soon. His name is Pierre. <laughs> I've known him for years. He's a great old fella. I don't know just where they find him.
I want to go on. Turn back before it is too late. Oh, no. I've come too far to turn back now. I'm too old to go all the way with you. Well, listen. Can, can't you get somebody to go with us? My people are afraid of the mountain. Why? Because it is called the land of the living dead. Well... Have, have you ever been there? I am the only man that ever came from there alive. There is an evil spirit man that is called murder. Come and tell you all about what it is. Just as old Pierre said, a cloud of vultures always hovers over the house of the living dead. Madeline, is she there? No. Oh, I must go and see. No, 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 no. Kneel, my boy. Please, please, lie down and rest. Please. You'll feel stronger in the morning. You rest. Let me go up and see what I can do. Yeah. 
Madeline! Madeline! Can you still hear me? It is unfortunate you are no longer able to speak. I should be interested to hear you describe your symptoms. You see, you are the first man to know what is happening. None of the others did. You refused to shake hands once, I remember. Well, well. We understand each other better now. Thank you. 
should know me, dear. It's Neil. I could swear. For a moment, she recognized you. No, he's he, he, and he will. Seriously? There's yeah. a face off right there. No, I'm just kidding. Oh, look at that. Oh, <laughs> look, wait, 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 stop, wait, stop, 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 stop. Are you good? No, we're all such a great time wait, here at Final Arcade. Yeah. We haven't even paid oh. attention to White Zombie, and wait. it's over. Wait. Oh, but then we're still arguing. Yeah. Greatest band of all time. Offs. The greatest band of all time is the Beatles. Beatles. Yeah. No, no, no. Well, you're gonna we're say, no, we're, we're arguing an old look, 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 like I should I'm not a Beatles Hooper. fan. I grant he was, he, they were, yeah. you know, anyway, so tonight's trivia. And they, they inspired so much, I get it. I, I don't I can't even remember what tonight's trivia was. I get that. It was tonight's trivia. Hey, whoa. No wonder the chairs don't work. And he's still talking. He's talking to a show here. Let's have a great yeah, song years ago, and I love that. Tonight's yeah. trivia yeah. was yeah. two-parter. Yeah. But I can't yeah. remember what parts they were, because he's still yet. Yeah. What were the two Nothing parts else. of your Nothing trivia? Else Hello? Nothing else mattered. What are the two parts of the trivia? You just keep talking. I'll oh, finish the show. Right. Uh, we well, yeah, we got a show. Well, you know what? It started it. I, I did start that. Started. I keep <laughs> set all up. He goes, no, 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 no face off. He got all defensive. Well, I came out, I came out too strong. Well, over well, that was again. mighty white. It was just like, let's have a show. throw hands over there for a minute. level comes out too strong. You want to throw hands? No, too far. I went the deep toe. I almost got it. I didn't say anything. I had to But all four of you guys all agree with the Beatles. I wouldn't yeah. say they're the greatest band of all time, like Ed almost hit me <laughs> with. But yeah, I, I, I think if I have to Between compare them. them who is the greatest why? band? Why? Well, which Paul McCartney do you why? like? Just the because they, they first Paul, the Paul, or the real the live one or the dead one? Yeah. Turn me on. Dad. That should be a face off. You, you, is there a false ball? You don't see it. You'll never. I mean, is there or not? I've been doing research on this past week. I don't know. Catalog. It's the what do you think of Yes, because you said five years ago you got into the stuff. I think you might. Check out your right, I will take <laughs> your advice. Let Just us know what you think. The hand behind his And if I agree, and I'm getting like, oh, hit for the trivia, though. He's just rambling and rambling. I He's a rambling man. Just right. rambling man. man. This is what happens no when I'm in the same room with people who think alike, except for Ed with his Beatles thing. But <laughs> other than that, we all think similarly. Yes. Yeah. Yeah. <laughs> he's like drunk with joy. Okay, you guys, you guys have he's drunk. making I'm him drunk. drunken with joy. I'm drunk. Good. He's all like, like with yeah. Kids. This is he just from the stone room. He's gonna be now. He's gonna be turning up at all your vinyl arcade gigs. He's gonna be at the back door like. To the horrible yeah. trivia, two-parter. Oh, here we go now. We're What's the, the name of Bella Lugosi's character? The murder of Legendre. What does Legendre mean? Well, you would think it means legend, but it doesn't. Doesn't. It's like flower or something. I mean, mean son of a son-in-law. Oh, oh, I son thought that's what they sold at Victoria's really? Secret. Really? Oh, Maybe. Yeah. Legendre. Son-in-law. Now, what's son the law. very odd thing about his name in this movie? It's never spoken. It's never spoken. That's weird. Never say I his name. Nobody wants to say murder. Oh. Find out who yeah. I guess so. Yeah. Wow. Isn't that weird? Isn't that dumb? I watched the whole thing, though. I, I know, right? Yeah. I actually got to watch this movie now. <laughs> I can never get through this. 
No. But now I actually did some research, and I'm not going to watch. Because you want to watch it, you want to see if I'm wrong. No, I want to see the ending. That well, ending is pretty cool. How do you know you didn't see it? Because I do my research. So when I'm not following vinyl arcade around. Now I didn't notice, but <laughs> is it written? Like Was puppy. it written somewhere <laughs> in the movie? His name. You know what? Good point. Good. Watch point. the movie and let me know. It, have to I, finish it. I don't yeah, think I the name even it. appears in the credits. Maybe it's to. Maybe it's written in his diary. I don't think it did. Or on his lunch pail. Uh, Frank Sinatra school. knows. Frank so Sinatra it's knows. Starring, starring <laughs> yeah. I don't think it's in the credits. Rocco. It's, 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 it's a debate backwards. that's yeah. gone out for years. No. This is a weird movie then. And then there's a sequel to this. It's the Revolt of the Zombies. It's a sequel. Oh, wow. A sequel to this movie. <laughs> What's it called? <laughs> Revolt of the Zombies. <laughs> Revolt of the Zombies. Can we show yeah. it? And they use some. Can we? Can we? we have? Oh. I don't know. How come we never put together? Like, should we watch it? Should we show it? Well, not right away. Maybe in the wintertime. We're going to show some good stuff coming up. We are. Right? Well, you said Devil Times 5. You wanted to see that? I want to show that again. No. Don't get Island. Oh my God, we're getting goofy for show that. No. <laughs> the, the basketball <laughs> player. One be, oh wait, right. Asylum. We're gonna we gonna show it. Yep. Oh, well, how about what I said? How about the giant spider invasion again? No. Yeah, that's a good one. Why again? Again. Kingdom again, of the again. Those are good movies. What movie did I say? I can't remember who I was. We'll find um, it. It's not the machine. We'll find it. Murder machine. Oh, well, no. murder oh. machine. We want spider request. No, we're showing what? We want to thank Vinyl Arcade for coming down. Yeah, we do. Stories. Oh, having some fun. Thanks for having us. They're coming oh, back when we show move. Deep Dark Woods. They're coming back. Yeah, oh. let's have them back. We'll you see argue them back about like often. We got to argue about fun, man. That was a blast. Let's just let them take over the show. Yeah, thank you. Don't forget. Deep good discussion. There's no wrong answers. We should have them. There's no wrong answers. No, I know it's all matter of opinion. Yeah, but it's it's good. I like Peter's album. I just don't like it better than the other thing. Yeah, I've never I, listened I, to any of them. Oh, I just had to add, I just really? had, I just had, I was never a <laughs> Which one Kiss fan. Like, I've probably oh. seen Kiss more than any other band, but was never a Kiss fan. Okay. All my friends were. Wow. But yeah, I just had to ask Keith, was Beth on yeah, Chris's? And he's like, no. I'm like, okay. <laughs> So I have no idea. So I'm a big loser. <laughs> I'm a big loser. I, yeah. I wouldn't go that far. No, no, I'm I not would. Very tall You're not at that all. tall. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> tall loser. You're a oh. small loser, Jim. Uh. I'm a big There's no kid. drama as long as you can handle being insulted. Yeah, on well, just like on this show. I hit my head on everything when yeah, I walk. Exactly. We only have fun. Yeah. So like, they think they good. Good. We keep an eye out. We always promote when they're yeah. playing out and where. Yeah, and so and check out vinylarcade.com. Look for them on Facebook. The you can best. see their schedule yes. when they're playing. They're playing all over the place. Lots summer of, you know, just so many times, yeah, throughout the summer. And just. I got to tell you, you have to check them out. It's such a fun time. It's a throwback to the 70s and 80s with the TV themes. <laughs> Why don't you guys sing us out with one of your... Uh, oh, no. Oh, come on. Oh, no, we do it. Give them a little taste. Do it all in the family. Do a little taste. Do oh, 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 or do something. Do something. Do one of your themes. What's your favorite Godzilla film? Oh, oh Lord. Oh. What? What's my favorite? I thought we had to go out. Now we're in Godzilla. Godzilla vs. Megalon. It was a good way to get out of singing. Godzilla. Godzilla vs. Megalon is my favorite Godzilla. I like Godzilla. Okay. It's I terrible. Know. You, talk about monster you know why? Monster you know why? God, I'm Growing up, films, really I loved loves Ultraman. Loves so Megalon. Yeah. Yeah. Jaguar. Yeah. 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 That's why I love yeah. Megalon. I don't like any giant right. monsters. They're not my thing. You love Johnny Sacco and Robot. Oh, I like them. Giant Sacco. I like Money So Young. Guys, give the viewers a taste of what they can hear when they go see We don't have our game. We're not ready. I'm not. There you go. Oh no 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 no! La 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 Good. That was it. Cool. <laughs> you left them with the hand in the air. Fun, oh my god. Fun time. You should start next See, week with the hand in the air. Yeah, it's awesome. so fun. Yeah, thank you guys so much. This so much. is fun. Thank, thank you. You, you guys are so center. cool.